Hi, my name is DJ. <laughs> Thank you. Welcome to my channel. It's going to be a mixed channel, um, but we're just going to feature this 2006 LS430. Um, I'm going to be doing a review of it today. Let you know a little bit about it. And let you see all the little tricks and features that it has. This is the Ultra Luxury Package. And I'm just doing a quick walk around. So just for you know, you get the idea so you can get the feel of it and everything. Let you see how gorgeous this is. There's five trim levels to this. Uh, one is the premium. Then it goes, no, it's the base premium. Then it goes to the modern luxury custom um, selection and then this one which is the ultra luxury now what makes this so what makes this ultra luxury is the radar guided cruise control the air suspension which has double wishbone by the way and then also the special treat for the rear passengers Starting out front, one of the cool features is the headlight. It swerves left and right and up and down. Um, very good visibility. Really, really, really good visibility. Um, for the year, everything works. Um, I think I've blown a fuse though on the heated headlight washer. Um, that's probably the only thing that is not like actually you know function it's not that it's making a noise and it just won't come up so i'm gonna check that out um in a later video also what i'm planning on doing is at the end of this i'm going to tell you all the stuff that i'm going to do um to the car it's not that much it's just small stuff but it, to me it make a major difference uh to the car so once again this is the outside and then to enter the car excuse me for the mess y'all um bird had a little accident anyway so to, ex to enter the car you just put your hand right here and it opens up to lock it you just push this button and it has it on all four doors including the trunk just you just there's a button underneath you just push that and it will come right up for you and stuff of that nature uh, one of the cool tricks is the second one is you just press and hold and all the windows plus the sunroof will come up i mean come down excuse me automatically all right it's time to hop in on the inside all right before we hop on the inside i just want to show you a cool feature another feature of the door car is the soft closed doors it has it on all doors plus the trunk i'm gonna try to show you again i hope y'all saw that i'm gonna do it on the other side just for y'all to get a you know better idea just in case it didn't come out like it was supposed to so check it you just i hope y'all saw that all right time to go on the end check out the condition of this leather it has Yamaha wood. Um, they did a collaboration with them. So this is real wood. Look at the condition of the car. Just, just look at it. Like I said, everything works. Y'all wouldn't guess how many miles this car has. I'm gonna let y'all guess and let me know in the comments. Um, but based upon what y'all see, let me know how y'all feel about how many miles let me know how much you think about how many miles this car has all right and at the end of this uh probably of the next video or video or two um i'm gonna go ahead and uh, reveal how many miles this has all right it's time to hop on inside all right that's the inside of the ls430 now in 06 you could change your to the fm this right here changes to the fm and stuff like that and then the mode and then change the presets too here's your volume control and then you can also set your preset 
right here, if you can see, let me see, right there is your voice command and your uh, cell phone button for your Bluetooth. 06 guys and telescopic steering wheel it has parking sensors and the mirrors automatically fold in and out so if just about if you push this button here they fold out sorry for that just not trying to show you the miles yet but i got y'all all right so to it has memory seats and then also to change and adjust your seat belt you just push that button right there it has like once again radar guided cruise control so you just push that button and then um, once it detects somebody in front of you it would adapt to that person's speed if they come to a complete stop or come to a complete stop with them everything is keyless so you can keep your key in the button this is like in between your push start and you know you put in your key in ignition this is just twist to turn also this has, uh, so if you put this on sport, it stiffens up the suspension. Um, the high is really meant for like if you're going over speed bumps and if you need to get over a high driveway. Um, but then throughout the whole thing, it has independent air suspension for all four. And then it has self-leveling rear depending on the load that's in the back. Um, and then constantly does it adjust the air pressure and the air ride throughout the drive experience. Also, there's a power and snow button. So if you put it on snow, I believe that it puts the transmission in second gear so you won't burn out your tires and spin out on ice and snow like that. So you just get a little better grip. Um, power is when you want uh, power throughout the RPMs and it wakes up the throttle body too. It has a rear sunshade. Um, I believe all the models have the traction control and then um, this button right, this button right here, resets the rear seats, and I'll show you exactly what that does in a little bit when we get in the back. Also has a heated headlight washer, heated and um, you know it headlight it cleans the headlight washer, heated and cooled or heated and ventilated front seats. That's an ashtray. I'm most likely going to put my cell phone there, but I'm not going to do anything. Uh, no one, you know, really smokes anymore nowadays. Six disc CD changer. Everything is automatic. Let me show you a little quick, another quick uh, Lexus feature. You push that button and it isolates the air condition uh, or the heat it just pushes air through the cabin and everything and it moves automatically isn't that cool it's, it's a little gimmicky but at the end of the day you can actually tell um, it does push air around and stuff like that which makes it pretty cool go ahead and turn it off now all right um here's your cup hold sorry for that here's your cup holders you just push this button right there and then voila your cup holders if you have, it's a two button latch, so if you pull the first one, it shows that. And then when you pull the second one, it gets you way more storage. Also, additionally, this has the James Bond 007. Cup holder where you could put stuff in it and stuff like that. Um, back to this real quick, you just push that out. I have the hand sanitizer because you got to be COVID friendly and COVID ready nowadays. You know what I mean? And then with that, you just simply, you can put your money or anything else like that. You simply just press the close. Nice size glove box. And then a coin holder. You just push this button. Sorry for that. There you go. Sorry. You have to push up on top of it. Push the button and then you can put your coins right there. All right. That's. On also another thing, you can control the rear headrest and slide your seat back and forth um, instead of reaching all the way over here to move your passenger side seat. All right, it's time to roll in the back. 
this car before we roll in the back sorry for that also this has dual control temperature so it has a tri-zone so uh, i mean an actual tri-zone you can control this side you can control the passenger control that side and then in the rear has its own like separate air conditioner it controls two vents back there and in the footwell i'm gonna show you all that in uh coming up next i forgot to also show you that it has puddle lights too that come on too at night and stuff of that nature now time for the back where all the good stuff is at so this is the back seats very very nice let me show you the it has a uh, manual curtains it is a 06 And I'm going to show you the other side, too. These doors open up pretty wide. Look how wide these doors open for their rear seat passengers. Now I'm about to show you the good stuff in the back. Let me go ahead and uh, put these shades back down. And then we're going to get into some good stuff here. All right, let me hop in the back. All right, we are in the back seat of the LS430. These, it has pivot, pivot um, what do they call it? like courtesy lamps, or if you want to call them like reading lights. And then it has a hook for your coat, uh, like coat or um, work jacket, or you know, any, any type of thing that could require getting hung up. The vents swerve left and right, up and down. Has a nice size vanity mirror. For, you know, as, as for the women, you know, to get their makeup and stuff right. Plus as men, you know, for we could groom and stuff of that nature. Now, here we go. Y'all ready? I'm excited to show y'all this. Very excited to show y'all this. So in the rear, you got, I know it's, it's not that complicated. In the rear, you have your seat controls, your headrest controls in the, for the rear. And this is a three stage. So it has three intensity levels for the vibrating massage. Um, it's not a sin issue or something like that, but it's just for the year. It, it, you can sleep back here. You can relax. It, it vibrates pretty good. It's not bad at all. Um, from the driver's side. I mean, excuse me, for the, pa for the driver's side and passenger side. It also has memory seats for both of the passengers back here. So if you, you know, custom getting back here, you can set your seats up the way you want it. So every time you hop in, it, um, you know, saves your spot. Um, back here, you can control the radio. And it also, like I said, has its own air conditioning. I mean, literally, you could... You could change the temperature and it does change the temperature up there too additional with this you have where you can i'm gonna change the mode real quick so you can put it on so you can just listen to it and you can change the sound stuff that you can change the radio station it's pretty cool now let's go ahead and change the seat and it actually gets you not a bad recline too. It's actually pretty good. Let's go ahead and turn on the the little massage. Like I said, three intensity levels. And then also you can change the headrest by pushing this button right here. Maybe I should show you on the other side real quick. So this will come out and then you like I said you could change the headrest too it has a cool box and it actually gets cool there's a little switch right here which I'm about to show you so when you have the ultra luxury package there's a little switch that actually pushes the cold air through here so you can go ahead and get your beverages cooled and everything else so if, you know for a family trip let me turn the light off for a family trip 
um, for you know if you have kids or whatever you can put their bottles back there your sodas or you know your water bottles or anything of that nature and keep it cool and you can actually feel like the air coming out right now through the back I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off now and then uh, when you open this up you got your two cup holders nice size cubby heated and cool or heated and ventilated seats to activate it you just push this button down and then you change it and it actually works um the heat is really good and then the uh the ventilated seats you could let me turn it on for you so you could you can hear it, the fan and you can actually feel some air getting pushed through this and then let me go ahead and show you the curtains I'm gonna go ahead and close it now and another little parlor trick is this parlor trick so check this out you got your seat fully out and everything and then when you open up the door it resets you so you can hop out comfortably without being there now isn't that cool now that is really cool i'm saying lexus attention to detail is really 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 phenomenal um, i'm also going to show you something else in the front real quick that i forgot so give me one sec what i forgot to show you is lexus attention to detail so you could put this down and to block all the sun from interfering with the driver they created a little curtain isn't that pretty cool guys like i'm serious the little things that lexus do also so when you eat fries or if you have keys in your pocket or you know like when you drop that thing in the center when you drop your keys or drop those fries you know you and your girlfriend um your girlfriend eating you eating so you just go ahead and drop your keys in here and there's a there's a little tube that comes out that prevents it from falling and then you just grab it and voila isn't that really cool we're gonna go to the trunk now all right to open up your trunk there's a little button right here and then look how of a nice size trunk this is i mean literally you could fit i could fit in here and i'm like uh five five eleven or something like that and I fit comfortably in here. Not that, you know, you're supposed to be putting anybody in here, but still, it's just really, really spacious. Um, this is the air purifier, which also has a filter and it has a black light um, filament in there too, to kill all the bacteria and stuff of that nature. Um, what's funny about this car, this car has seven filters and I'm gonna tell you about that in a second. But um, think about Tesla, how they had their hazard. This is just, not as advanced as that but might as well is, is close but not that close if that makes sense all right so in all lexuses well not all of them but in the, the ls they give you a full size spare emergency aid kit a toolbox Uh, when your electronic gas lever um, malfunctions you could just pull it manually this right here is how you access your headlights your tail lights are to change them once again soft closed doors so check this out let me see if i can show y'all that just a little bit better all right now to oh let me show you something i forgot to mention sorry for that um front and rear uh parking sensors too uh, now i'm about to show you the engine so give me one second before i show you the engine i just wanted to show you um how to so you push this rear button and see how i got that set and it readjusts it and puts it back 
into its original. This is Lexus's V8. It's a 4.3 liter. Man, is it good. This is a very reliable, good car. I mean, my gosh. I'm going to tell you about my journey to get here to let you know about the gas mileage and stuff of that nature. Let's hop back inside for that. So my journey, um, I had to, I was in Chicago at the time. I had to fly from Chicago to North Carolina and then drive from North Carolina to here, to Maryland. Um, when I did that, uh, the car, he, the guy gave it to me at a half a tank. So from driving around a little bit in North Carolina to driving back in Maryland, I only had to fill it up once. And then when I got back, um, I was at like, 35 40 percent remaining in the tank so that's not bad um i think it's about 22 gallons anywhere from 20 to 22 gallons and yes it does take premium but that is just the life and ownership of owning a lexus um but it's been very reliable like i said everything works so now i'm about to tell you what i had planned for the car so let me go ahead and flip the camera back around and show you what i'm going to do or possibly do too all right so, I'm going to have a video on headlight restoration. I'm going to change the hood struts because they're a little weak. Um, and then I'm going to, like I said, get the uh, fuse or whatever this is for the heated headlight washer. I'm going to change the puddle lights to LED. Any interior light is getting changed to LED. So anything with a bulb that I could possibly find, that I could possibly do, I'm swapping it over to LED. Uh, in the rear, I'm gonna try to get LED reverse up. I'm gonna get, I'm not gonna try, or I'm going to get the LED reverse lights, LED turn signals. Um, so anything LED is what I'm gonna do for it. And um, for the rear, it has a Mark Levison sub. So what I also am gonna have a video on is the uh changing the sub and adding a kicker to it i think i'm gonna do a kicker it's gonna be a direct swap might do a little bit customization because i gotta drill it just a little bit but other than that it's gonna be a direct swap and then uh for the curtain another cool feature about it is when i put it in reverse it automatically will go down for me um so i can have better visibility and stuff of that nature and that's about it for the LS430. I'm not gonna really do too much to it. Oh, also, um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and buy a Bluetooth adapter for this because it has the Bluetooth for the cell phone, but it doesn't have the Bluetooth for video, uh, for music streaming. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and buy the, that's like two or three companies that make it. So I'm gonna go ahead and look at which one is the best and go ahead and put that on in the car. Other than that, that is it. Um, I don't have the equipment right now to do the uh, point of view drive. So that would be the next video um, or a video down the road. Uh, as soon as that equipment come in, I'm going to go ahead and give you the point of view drive on the car and everything else. So once again, this is DJ and I appreciate you watching and um, take it easy. Have a good day and I'll see you on the next video. One more walk around guys. Have a good day. Bye.